August 1914 saw all of Europe preparing for war, and many young soldiers enlisting to serve king and country to fight in what would be known in history as World War I. Men of all ages and classes sought out the recruiting sergeants in their towns to enlist and be shipped out to war. Boys as young as 12 would attempt to pass themselves off as older men to be part of this new and exciting adventure. Not unbeknown to the recruiting officers, familiar faces that had been turned away a few days prior were enlisted as 19-year-olds a day later. One hand in the air and the other on the Bible, the men from all walks of life swore to fight for the crown as witnessed by God. It was expected that the war would end by Christmas. It instead carried on for four years, ending in the year 1918. In 1916, 69% of men eligible to enlist in the war in New Zealand had not done so. In order to maintain the country's commitment to the war, it was of unpopular decision that there would be conscription, and by 1918, over a quarter of the NZDF were enlisted under conscript. Conscription was put in place to maintain numbers, replacing the continuous fall of the military with more soldiers to continue fighting. The war would be a significant event for New Zealand and Australia, putting them on the map and making a name for themselves. Get 